Hello friends, it is a Costco shopping day. I have less than 45 minutes, so we gotta get inside. Less than an hour ago, we got back from a week at our cabin and I opened up the refrigerator and it was completely empty. We have a camping trip in two days. Today is Saturday. We've got Sunday, we don't go shopping on Sunday. And then Monday morning, we're leaving for another trip. I needed to come shopping. For this camping trip coming up, I'm in charge of two dinners and two lunches, but I also have to make sure that there is food at home for Mark because he's not coming with us. He's working this week, so we got we got groceries to get. First up, Luna needs some food. $23.69. Pita's $4.99. $5.99 for $24. $2.99. $6.99. Right now these are on sale for $6. They make it so easy for camping, so I'm gonna grab two get our veggies in. $7.99. $9.99. I've never seen this before. It's called a golden hammy melon for $5.99. Never seen that before. Tell me, what does it taste like? Okay, I need a special breakfast for tomorrow and some of our viewers have said these are amazing, $12.99. I just don't have time to make anything, so I'm grabbing two. This is something I've never seen before. They're little cups full of chicken salad, rotisserie chicken salad. $13.99 for eight of them, that's interesting. These are on sale for $10.99, I'm gonna stock up and this is one of our meals for camping. Never tried this before, but I need an easy side dish, $11.99. Tzatziki, $7.99. Now I just need to find the hero meat, but I'm not seeing it. That was one of my meals. It's just so easy. I'm gonna put these back. I realize the kids just like regular mac and cheese. $13.05 or $3.39 a pound for a slab of ham. We're hiding. Yes, eleven ninety nine each. Those were the last three. I need them. Yay! Oh, I'm glad I looked again. I feel so relieved. Nine seventy nine. such a rush I just finally looked at my notes and I missed a few things so I'm gonna have to go back a little bit $5.99 the ones that I was gonna get are not here but I think these will work okay no red onions I'll get those at Fred Meyer one of the reasons I was late coming here was because something got delivered while we were at the cabin and I just had to take care of it. I will show you when I get home. If you've been around for a while, you'll be really excited for me that this finally came. fancier ones but this has the number that I need in it so I'm gonna grab these this time 1079 as opposed to spending $30 to get the 20 that I need 
$21.49 for a special dinner tomorrow. I usually buy fresh broccoli, but we're just in and out of the house so much, I wanna have some on hand. $9.89 for the frozen broccoli. $7.59. $19.99, I don't usually buy these, but camping, it probably will be good. $6.49 for some potato salad. I'm gonna put this with our chicken sandwiches. Never seen this before. Lime nectar. $6.49 for two. Oh, my cart's getting heavy. This is like a workout. I'm sweating. We're moving fast. It's good. $16.69. I don't remember the last time I bought mac and cheese, so I just want to make sure I have some because I don't know what we have in the garage. $16.69. want to make sure I have a couple boxes to take with me. Okay. Check my list one more time. Heroes, hot dogs, banana boats, chicken sandwiches, spaghetti, fruits, and those roll shit. I think we've got mostly what we need. Okay. $8.29. We're going to make it. $13.99. Ooh, this is new. They made thin mitt bites, crispy center with mint and dark chocolate. $10.69. I get those for Mark as a little present. I think I'm going to. $14.99. Okay, in case you like to guess how much I'm spending, here's our cart. We did it. We've got five minutes to spare. just have to show you these beautiful trees that are in bloom. South Central Alaska has had record low temperatures in May and June. We've only had like three or four days over 60 degrees, so everything is just behind. This probably should have happened in May, but this is gorgeous. This tree full of blooms. There's another purple one over there. All over the parking lot. This mid-June is feeling like end of May. <laughs> Hopefully that means we'll have a late summer. Oh, I had a feeling that was going to feel fast and furious. Not a ton of time to browse, but I got it done. I am so relieved. Let's get home. I'll show you my surprise, tell you the total and show you the haul. Okay, thanks for helping boys and Jossie. <laughs> Grateful to have help unloading. Hello, Miss Luna. Are you showing our surprise? Back in November, I ordered a refrigerator. It came with the wrong color doors. It's just a glass insert piece. They were kind of like a light blue. We love the refrigerator. We've gotten used to it, but our white doors finally arrived. So this afternoon when we got home, that's the first thing I did. I was so excited. I switched out the doors. Dun, da, da, da. Now we have a completely white fridge to match our stove. I know some of you loved the blue. 
I didn't hate it. I kept the blue doors. They're gonna be down in the basement in case I ever wanna switch it up, but I am happy to have the white doors. Just feels complete now. All right, I'm gonna show you the haul really quick. Usually I organize it by type of thing. The kids put everything out. I just don't have time. <laughs> I need to keep moving tonight. Miss Luna is here checking things out. Let's show you the haul. So I got two of these salads. We love these Mediterranean salads. They're just good for easy, quick salads. We're in summer mode. We need fast, quick things. Shopping just looks different in the summer because of that. Oranges, two vegetable trays to make sure we're eating veggies while we're camping, baby carrots. Um, I realized they gave me the person behind these chips. So I ended up with two chips. I did pay for them, but one of these was supposed to go to the person behind me, so I feel bad that they're gonna get home without chips. This is for a special meal tomorrow. This is for camping, chicken patties, two things of bananas. The kids became obsessed with banana boats. You cook them over a campfire. Um, so they asked if we could do those while we're camping next week, so I got some more bananas. We got some grapes, French bread, hot dog buns, hamburger buns for the chicken patties. Just sandwich bread, mangoes, frozen broccoli. Got to get those into the freezer. Here's our second salad. Lettuce. Three things of the pineapple bacon because they're on sale and we've been going through these quite fast in the summertime. Three gyro meat things. We'll take two of those camping and then one will go in the freezer. Gogurts, mac and cheese. Mac and cheese. Mac and cheese. Yeah, Everett. Milk. Ham, did get some food for Luna, we were getting low. Some Gatorades, these are for the gyro meat. Potato salad, I thought that would go good with the chicken sandwiches. And some tzatziki sauce for the gyros. Pistachios, chips, these are for Mark for tomorrow. I think that's everything. Whew, that's the end. All right, let's see, what did we spend today? Let me find my receipt. Okay, our total for today was $413.97. We are set for camping for the next week. We are set for tomorrow's special dinner. We got a few more things up our sleeve for this video, so stick around. Luna has the zoomies. What's going on? What's going on? Huh? You excited to have us back? You excited to have us all home? Got to chase everybody. Is somebody hiding behind the couch? Is that why you were... <gasps> I found you! Luna revealed your hiding spot. What is this? Red Spicy Spicy heart. <laughs> As part of Mark's Father's Day gift, we're vacuuming out the car. I think they have some rags that we can use to clean the cup holders. These are cinnamon rolls for dad. For We're celebrating dad today. Dad. Father's Day. Dad. Love you. I haven't had the chance to like be artistic in a long time, but at the cabin I did a lot of drawing. And so I came home and made this card for my dad. I'm gonna make one for Mark, but I gotta get ready for church first. Made him a red salmon, about to get caught by my dad. We're all signing it. Okay. Sundays are about the only days that I've been doing my hair and makeup during the summer. So they feel extra special. <laughs> Let's go take a picture. I bought Mark and the boys matching ties, and so we are going to take some pictures. After church, it was time to make a special Father's Day feast. Mark had a very specific thing in mind using this octopus that we caught the day before at the cabin. He has been dreaming of making this dish since he made it a year ago. 
and so he decided to make his own Father's Day meal just so he could have exactly what he wanted. As you can see, we pretty much were all there in the kitchen making it with him. It was a really nice experience and everybody loves to sample the octopus before it ever makes it into any dish. So he is making like a noodle dish with a bunch of veggies and octopus and shrimp and we're really excited to try it. None of us were with him when he made this the last time, so it would be a special treat. Be careful. Well, that was more than I wanted to do, but that's okay. You want it. All upside down. I, I thought it would be. I have to. Oh, I wish those noodles were ready. They should be soon, though. Every day. Careful. It's really hot. It is. Okay, mom, dinner's ready. Maybe some chopsticks or something. Oh, All right, so we've got some leftover uh, stir-fry noodle seafood dish with shrimp and octopus. And uh, it's more than I can eat in the next day or so. The family's gonna be out of town, so we're gonna freeze dry this and see how it, how it works and see if we can eat it up on the mountain sometime while we're hunting this fall. All right, let's finish off the day with a special little card that I painted for Mark. It's a spear fisherman. I did mess up right there, so I'm covering it up because I was so sad. I've run out of time. I can't make a new one, but that's the card I made for Mark. And yes, it is Father's Day. Our videos do not come out right away. A lot of it is for our family's safety. Just, you know, we don't want everybody to know where we are all the time. So thank you so much for spending time with me shopping. And then for a couple Father's Day little treats here. We are so grateful for Mark. He is an awesome dad, husband, father. We just can't say enough good things about him. We love each and every one of you. And we'll see you again real soon for more of this Alaska life. We're heading on another trip. I'm going to show my pictures. Does it look good? Do you like it? I don't know if you like it. Comment as well. Bye!